In this video, I'm going to show you how to create videos in one of the most profitable YouTube channel niches right now with countless of channels blowing up and gaining millions of views and making more than $10,000 per month. If you haven't guessed, I'm talking about the make money online with AI niche. So like many other successful channels, we will start with giving your channel an identity by creating a talking avatar. After that, we will cover how to come up with video ideas, how to create the video and how to monetize your channel before it even reaches the YouTube monetization threshold. The best part, I'm going to show you how to achieve all these using 100% free AI tools. So without much further ado, let's get started. To create the avatar, we are going to use Leonardo AI and Bing Image Generator. We will use Leonardo AI to create our fake studio. To start, go to Leonardo.ai, click Image Generation and set the aspect ratio to 16 by 9 and type your prompt in the line of something like, design a realistic neon studio setup, cyberpunk background, front view, with a table and computer. You can change your prompt to be far more detailed than this and be as creative as you can. You can cite specific color, lighting setting, windows, and much more. With that, Leonardo AI generated pictures I wasn't quite satisfied with, which is why I decided to make yellow as the dominant color in our branding. For that reason, I tasked Leonardo AI to design a realistic yellow neon studio and it came up with a picture I liked. After the studio was generated, I moved to Bing Image Generator to generate our character. In case you were wondering why didn't you create the character in the same Leonardo? The reason is I find Bing Image Generator to be far better than Leonardo AI when it comes to character generations. To generate the character, I gave Bing a prompt in the line of, cartoon of a male character in his early 20s, with headphones and a black packable cap, sitting upright, looking straight into the camera in a very nice and expensive cyberpunk studio setup, without a table in front, wearing a yellow hoodie. That without a table in front command is very important because it will allow us to drop the character at the back of a table we will design. With that prompt, Bing Image came up with four different images and thankfully one will be a perfect fit. To proceed with our character generation, I moved to Canva. Don't worry if you don't like Canva, you can achieve the same thing in another software like CapCut. From Canva, I clicked on video with a 16 by 9 and imported our generated images. I dragged the generated studio to the canvas then I placed the character. I used the background remover since the character is sitting in a studio. I understand the background remover is a pro feature so if you are not using Canva Pro you can go to remove.bg for a free alternative. After that, you can re-important the free standing character, or rather, free sitting. Now that we have our studio and the character we need to place computer table and the rest of the stuffs. To place the table, search table in the elements tab and go to photos to select the one you like. Adjust both the table and the character to your liking before adding computer, microphone and any other thing you want to place. After that, click rectangle, choose black as the color, add it to the table and adjust the opacity. To make our character more realistic, duplicate it and rotate it to 180 degrees, adjust the opacity to give the impression of reflection. Before I add the computer, microphone, speaker and flower pot, I went back to Leonardo AI and designed all of them and imported them to Canva. Feel free to add anything that will make the studio look better and more realistic. After adding these, it's time to animate our character. There is a free and paid way, but I'm gonna leave the paid way out since I promised everything for free. To give our character the impression of talking, search for a Chrome extension called Colorzilla install it. Click on the Colorzilla extension, click on your character's face, draw a rectangle on your character's mouth and paste the color that the Colorzilla saved. After that, search for a talking mouth green screen on YouTube, download it and import to Canva. Again, if you're using Canva free version head to CatCut, remove the green screen for free and import the mouth to Canva. Once you remove the background, adjust it to fit your character's mouth perfectly. With that, our talking avatar is ready. In case you were wondering, I didn't create a masked avatar because I have a phobia for mask, would you believe that I can't stand to use it even as for my avatar? If you want a perfect lip sync, you will have to opt for a paid tool like Synthesia. Please like and subscribe to the channel if you are getting value out of this. Now we will move to video generation, but first, how do you come up with a video topic? The best way to do that is to go for a premium tool like vidIQ who will show you keyword search volume, keyword difficulty, historical data, and much more. What most beginners do is if they see another channel made a video on a particular topic and gained a lot of views they think that if they target the same keyword their video will also go viral. This is completely wrong because it's possible that the topic was popular a few months or a few weeks ago but now its views per hour across YouTube has massively declined meaning that it's no longer trending. vidIQ can show you all that data. But if you are really strapped for cash you can use the YouTube search bar and come up with many video ideas. For the sake of this video, I decided to search how to make money with AI and then add A. You can see many interesting topics like how to make money with AI art, how to make money with AI art on Fiverr. If we add B you will see topics like how to make money with AI bots, how to make money with AI blogs. I added O and saw how to make money with AI on YouTube, how to make money with AI on Fiverr. I decided to go with how to make money with AI on Fiverr. But you should of course do further research on the topic before selecting it when it comes to you. 
Before crafting our script, I did some research on some of the least competitive gigs one can sell on Fiverr and how to leverage the power of AI to deliver those service. I found out that infographic animation, whiteboard animation, and logo animation is among them. I immediately thought of an AI software I used before that can help in delivering these gigs, which is RenderForest. From here I told ChatGPT that I have a YouTube channel called Leveraging AI and I wanted to create a video script on how to make $100 per day with AI selling three low competition gigs on Fiverr. I ask it to later reveal in the script that we will be using one AI software to deliver all those gigs and that the name of the software is RenderForest. I added that the low competition gigs it should mention are infographic animation, whiteboard animation, and logo animation. I also added that it should make a clear and engaging introduction that will hook the viewer to the end and it should not reveal the software or the gigs early in the video. Predictably, ChatGPT will not come up with your script to a sufficient length, and in that case, what you should do it is divide your prompts into four or five and add some human touch. You can decide to prompt it to generate a very engaging intro on how to make $100 per day with AI selling three low competition gigs on Fiverr. The second can be like how to make $100 per day selling infographic animation gig on Fiverr using RenderForest and in the same style the remaining gigs and then the conclusion. I did the same thing and came up with a very good 2000 word script. Maybe I will create a video on it in the future. Comment Fiverr in the description if you want me to create the video. But for the purpose of this video I will just copy a paragraph from the script, show the tools you need to create the video and how you can earn money with it. If I show how to make the full video this video will be more than 30 minutes long. To generate the voiceover you can either use 11 Labs or if you are on a budget, Clipchamp. Open Clipchamp, go to record and create, select text to speech, paste your script, select the voice you want after you listen to them then click save. Convert your audio to MP3. To create your video you need a screen capturing software and for that I recommend either Clipchamp or OBS Studio. I use OBS and it's actually pretty good and best of all free. You will need your OBS or Clipchamp in the background and whenever you want to record your screen you click on it and go to start recording located in the right down corner. Before creating the video, make sure that you have used the software you were planning to promote or even showcase in your video. So we will go to renderfirst.com, login, and leave the window open. To create our video, we will use Canva. We will click video, start with blank canvas, and import our voice over and generate a talking avatar. Our scripts start with, when you search for whiteboard animated videos on Fiverr. So we will go to fiverr.com, click on start recording on OBS Studio, and capture our screen. We search for whiteboard animation on Fiverr and show our viewers the result. Okay, I see that now it's 3,300 gigs but I swear it was around 2,900 when I wrote this script. Import the clip into Canva, crop and adjust it to fit perfectly. For the next sentence we will add our talking avatar. For the remaining clip we will show people how RenderForest AI can create a whiteboard animation from text. If you are creating a long video you will need to search for appropriate stock footage and you can find them on Canva, Pixabay, Pexels, Unplash and the likes. After you put all the scenes, you can decide to add transitions between the scenes, add background music, and export. Before I play our generated video, there is the question of how do you monetize your video before hitting 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. If you have the goal of monetizing a video like this, the first thing you need to do is go to RenderForest and check whether they have an affiliate program. Make sure you stand by any software or service you plan to promote, in the sense that it will help your viewers and it has great value for money. As it happens, RenderForest is a great software with decent pricing and they happen to have an affiliate program. They have an affiliate program and can pay you up to 40% commission on monthly subscription or up to 20% on yearly subscriptions. All you have to do is apply, get accepted and start promoting on your video. You can also promote Fiverr gigs or Fiverr sub affiliates. Speaking of affiliate links, some of the links I have down below are affiliate links and I will really appreciate it if you sign up for the software or the services through my links, it will help support the channel. Now let's play our video. When you search for whiteboard animated videos on Fiverr, you will see that less than 3,000 people are offering this gig and many of them have hundreds of reviews. If you have never created this type of videos don't be intimidated because RenderForest make it incredibly easy. To start, choose a template. They offer a wide range of templates to suit different needs. Pick the one that fits your project. You can even input your script.